this uh, direct. Please note, due to COVID-19 release dates and other information presented in this video are subject to change for additional updates. Please check out the official Nintendo website and social media channels. Uh, as well as those other publishers. It's not even enough time to read that. Our hearts go out to all those impacted by COVID-19 during this challenging time. Long ago, two great titans came into existence. Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition? The Bionis and the Maconis. The titans were locked in a timeless battle. Until at last, only their lifeless corpses remained. Yep, it is. In the sky! This can't be! No way! It's a. Mechon! Commence the assault on Vionis! The Monado. It's the only sword that's effective against the Mechon armor. If we could just. unlock the Monado's power. It's my turn! Silk! No! It'll kill you! 25. Shulk. Oh, 30 minutes. Ah! Or 28 minutes. There was something strange. It was as if I could see into the future. I don't believe this, but Shulk can see the future. I didn't know you could do that. It's not me. Oh, he can. It's the power of the Monado. And so it begins. The resurrection of the Bionis. I've been waiting for you, Monado boy. The future I see, it isn't set. Father! So I can use this power to change the future. And that's exactly what I intend to do. Mekon. It's not over. The people of Vionis will never let you triumph. May 29th. All right, nice. is on the shoulder there are people there I thought you'd want to go now we get some the gameplay ultimate version of a modern classic Xenoblade Chronicles definitive edition on Nintendo switch the game looks better and plays smoother than ever before be nice to play at 60 the FPS. The HUD and menu screens are easy to read and easy to use. And some of the music has been re-recorded. Now you can fully immerse in the majesty of this vast world. And a new epilogue, a new story. Hmm. Future, Future connected, connected will cap off the main game. So if you've played and loved the original game, you can I not get only this. revisit it, but look forward to one more adventure with Shulk. Good thing I came prepared. We'll probably be needing this. Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition launches on May 29th. All right. And you can pre-purchase the game starting today. Also coming on May 29th, the Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Works Whoa. set will pack in a 250-page art book. I'm just going to get the base game. I'm going to get the base game. Hi I didn't everyone, play the second one ever. To Nintendo Direct Mini. We've got news on upcoming Nintendo Switch games, and we're focusing on a selection of them coming out this year. Now, let's roll through some headlines, shall we? Three of 2K's most beloved series are coming soon to the Nintendo Switch system. What? Hey.
so this is um I don't care about XCOM. Those borderlands? I thought it said only two games. This is Borderlands 3. I don't even know. No, I don't even know. I thought that was more than two games. Oh, it's Bioshock and Borderlands. Oh, well, that's more than two games. Why are they saying two games? It's three games. Old enemies face off in a new trailer for the Marvel oh. Ultimate Alliance 3 The Black Order Expansion Pass. I thought it said Doom Eternal. You so-called heroes have filled this world too many times. You are no match for Doom's power. to say you are wasting your time fools doom always prevails that's available now doom right. must become a god himself all right in the darkest depths of the ocean lies a really fun game. You are the last of the human race, forced by a global winter into an unexplored aquatic world. In this deep sea exploration game, you'll collect resources to upgrade your gear, craft items, and dive deeper into the abyss. As you explore increasingly hostile environments, you better watch those oxygen and pressure levels. And if that's not challenging enough, Shinsekai's Time Attack Mode, Another Dive, boasts a perilous maze for you to race through, culminating with a final monstrous threat. You know, it can get pretty heavy down there, so why not lighten the mood with the jukebox feature? It lets you remix the game's background music by modifying audio filters. The time has come to discover the truth hidden beneath the ocean's surface. When Shinsekai Into the Depths launches on Nintendo hmm. Switch, Today. Today. All right. From Capcom. Animal Crossing. Live your best deserted island life thanks to this free update. Enjoying island life in the Animal Crossing New Horizons game? Well, whether you're already living it up on the island or you're still planning your departure, there's an event coming up and we're happy to spill the beans. Er, crack the eggs? You see, after downloading the free update we made available at launch, one zipper T Bunny will visit your island in celebration of Bunny Day in early April. For Easter. Can you hunt down the What's that April 12th, I think? Plus, you can craft these special limited time items from the egg series. The Bunny Day event only comes once a year, this time from April 1st yep. to April 12th. So <coughs> be sure to participate. And I will. Guess what? There's another free update coming later in April. It'll usher in some newly added features, including the Earth Day event. Of course, we'll continue to bring you the latest on updates. I thought Earth Day was in March. Via the official Animal Crossing Twitter account and other channels too. So stay tuned. We hope you enjoy the updates and everything else about your life on the deserted island. Hey, look! Someone's hiring. Oh, this is your dad's company? Apparently, they offer a wide range of services. The job description entails many responsibilities. You'll deliver items, mop the floor, and maintain a comfortable work environment. They're trusting you with crane operation and hmm. other tough tasks. Uh-oh, that projector won't do. Hmm, think you can take care of that? 
Whether you conduct yourself in a professional manner or opt for more creative solutions, do what you need to do to get the job done. Hey! Yeah, I didn't hear about it either. What's up, Lava? Hopefully, you're ready to join the team and be put to work immediately. <clears throat> because Good Job launches today. Was that two or three games that came out today? Catherine, full body, the mature action adventure puzzler, is coming to Nintendo Switch. Oh. Contemplating the next step in his relationship, commitment phobic Vincent finds himself pulled into the allure of a new love. Looks like poor Vincent's caught in a love quadrangle with Good morning. Catherine, Catherine with a C, and Rin. Little does he know, temptation might lead to his own demise. Wild World in now? Cult nice. Classic, your choices will affect how their relationships unfold, and it only gets weirder. Deservedly, not only is Vincent riddled with guilt during the day, he's also not sleeping so soundly. Looks weird. Every night, his nightmares consist of a crumbling tower of puzzle blocks that he must climb in order to survive and see another day. Find out if love is over for our troubled bachelor in this dark, intense, and intoxicating story when Catherine Full Body releases on uh, Nintendo Switch July 7th. Yeah, I'm not getting that. So it's a Sega game. Well, Atlas is owned by Sega, so it's a Sega game. game will pump up its audio. Hmm. I forgot about that game. Hmm. Mario Odyssey. Mix things up with the new rhythm game mode. If you want to set a high score, you got to get your body moving to the beat. Speaking of, there are 17 music tracks in the rhythm game. We're talking music from Super Mario Odyssey, hmm. Splatoon 2, and The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Nice. We fit. <laughs> Full body. On top of that... I'd be bad at this. There's probably a difficulty, though. I feel my power returning! Your companion rings... Why did they change the voice? voice oh, okay. Oh, okay. And you'll also be able to change languages. Feel free to change it up in the settings whenever you want. We're also adding in a new jogging option in both the custom and quick play modes. When you're not in a battling mood, you can simply run through a variety of fields. If you like exercising, then you might want to look into it. for the Ring Fit Adventure game will be available today. I haven't played that game much because my controller's broke. Better open the gates, one treasured TRPG approaches. Since 1990, the King's Bounty series has been influencing one the One entertainment, of never RPGs. heard of that. And now it's back with a fresh look and a new approach. This straight up sequel will pit army against army, sending the player on a quest around the world to save the world. This time, the graphics are more realistic. Your choices matter more than ever. And so does the terrain you stand on. So master your surroundings like the master strategist you are. Across the land, you'll meet new people whose ethics and affinities are informed by the new character development system. And affinities are informed oh. by the new character development system. Oh, sorry system. about that. Find out just how deep the gameplay will get when King's Bounty 2 launches on Nintendo Switch in 2020. When did this direct take place? Uh, apparently today. Super like Smash Brothers 15 Ultimate minutes ago it was uploaded. Approaches. Or something like that. It was recently the just uploaded. included in Wave 6 of the paid Super Smash Brothers Ultimate DLC will be... Arms. Okay. Joining the battle from Arms. This fighter is a bit unusual thanks to those extendable arms. So we'll have to extend our development time too. Please stay tuned for just a bit longer. The next spider will be announced and released oh, okay. this June. So it'll be in arms. It'll be announced in June or it's releasing only in June. That's probably what they meant. Don't it'll be a release and be announced sooner than that. <laughs> a free game trial of arms will be available exclusively to Nintendo Switch Online members. These elite fighting superstars share one thing in common. Extendable That's arms. That's my dog. So equip super powered arms to create a slew of combinations. For a limited time, you can try out the full game for free. Now, let's get stretchy. Why not just release a permanent demo? Feeling good? 
Well, all right. Then how about we take a nice You're getting that right now? At Bravely Default 2. Uh, where where am I? Can't believe I survived. Water, wind, earth, nature's masters. The great stone's power exceeds the hand of man. And if unleashed, would bring down death, Bravely default disaster, to. calamity, and blight upon the land. Heroes of light, may the crystals guide you. <coughs> this is the crystal's blessing. Who no swear the details, eh? Don't stand on ceremony either. If I've helped even one person, then I've done the right thing. This tale unfolds on the continent of Excellent, home to five mighty kingdoms. The saga begins when our hero Seth, a young sailor, washes up on the shores of one such kingdom. Well, at least I'm alive. Here, he meets Gloria of Musa, a princess who was forced to flee her kingdom when it was destroyed by evil forces bent on stealing its crystals. You dare claim the crystals? You do not know their worth. He also encounters two travelers determined to decipher a mysterious and magical book. This looks Elvis good. And or Adele. weird. This looks weird. I'm a certain special book to be deciphering. We're not friends Elvis? or anything. I'm just here because he hired me. As if guided by fate, our heroes What's this game called? and set off together on a grand Bravely mission, Default 2, I thought they said. filled with a sense of purpose. But there will be those who stand in their way. Those who have gotten hold of special items known as asterisks. These stones allow their holders to take on jobs, such as Thief or Black Mage. Becoming infinitely more powerful in the process. Okay, let's do this. I shall steal it all. Every last treasure Your in the mouth's not fire. moving. During battle, you must decide when to use brave points. Or uh, yes, it is. The life in May. The game's turn based <clears throat> system. The key to victory lies in knowing when to use the brave and default commands. Choose Brave to spend BP in order to allow characters to perform additional actions. Choose Default to order a character to guard, reclaiming a BP in the process. Strategically hold back or take multiple actions in one turn. The preacher sure shoots us up. The right choice. Right. You must consider your character's roles and statuses at all times. Should you manage to fell an asterisk holder, you will acquire their asterisk, allowing you to take on the associated job. Jobs can be combined at will, greatly expanding your strategic options and influencing the development of your characters. <laughs> I'll take that. Oh, excuse me. Now for a little announcement. A demo version of the game hmm. will launch today. Launch and almost future, everything today. We'll conduct a survey to gather feedback and incorporate what we can as we finalize the game. We hope you'll participate. The latest entry in Square Enix's beloved series, Bravely Default 2, will release this year. I'm gonna get Xenoblade Chronicles. Hope you're having fun. I didn't ever play the second Let's one. I kind of want to play that one too. I'll play the first first. Tabletop classics from hmm. around the world will come together on Nintendo Switch. So it's almost over. Hmm. Pool table, cards. Presenting every single game included in this massive new collection Solitary. of fun from around the globe. All right. Menkala, Hanafuda, Backgammon, 
Renegade, Checkers, Checkers. President, President, Domino, that's what it's called. Speed, Hare and Hounds, Blackjack, Four in a Row, Chess, Shogi, Mini Shogi, Ludo, Richie Mahjong, Sevens, Golf, Darts, Texas Hold'em, Nine Men's Morris, All right. Air Hockey, War, Carom. Chinese checkers, yacht dice, takoyaki, billiards. How much will Next. this be? If it's cheap, I might get it. But I don't like cards. So. Matching, bowling, shooting gallery, slot cards, dots and boxes, hit and blow, pig's tail, mahjong solitaire, last card, fishing, Klondike solitaire, toy tennis, toy soccer, toy curling, toy boxing, toy baseball, battle tanks, team tanks, sliding puzzle, and <coughs> six ball puzzle. Oh. Phew. That really is 51 games. I'm gonna already take and set to there are many ways to play them. Some games are multiplayer, including options for up to four people, playing hmm. via local wireless, and in some cases, online play is supported too. Choose three games, match up with other players, and mm. just play. Mm -hmm. Play to your heart's content <coughs> against rivals the world over. When Clubhouse Games 51 Worldwide Classics launches on Nintendo Switch June 5th, pre-purchase begins today. I'll probably just wait until it's cheaper. Will the real Master Ninja please stand? Battle tanks from the Wii. Oh, so you're the ultimate ninja, are you? Ninjala. Well then, prove it in battle. As one of eight players, you must earn the most points to claim victory. Sprint across stages. And show off your gum ninjutsu like only you can. By chewing ninja gum, you can dash at high speeds. Hmm. Disguise yourself and wield an arsenal of skills. And speaking of arsenals, from heady hitting hammers to fast and flashy katanas to tactical tricked out yo yo's, your choice of equipment could mean the difference between domination and defeat. Ninjas thrive in clans, so cement your supremacy in four on four team battles that prove ninjas are most clever when they work together. Will your efforts end in gummy disaster? Or prove you're the master? When Ninjala sneaks up on Nintendo Switch May 27th. And hey, it's free to play too. Hmm. Oh. Check out what you can play on Nintendo Switch. Star Enter Wars? Luke Skywalker's Jedi Academy oh. to learn the ways of the Force. I forgot Customize about this game. Customize your look, play a role in this Star Wars story, and battle online with up to 16 players. Star Wars Jedi Knight Jedi Academy launches on Nintendo Switch today. Mm. And get ready to strap in because Star Wars Episode One Racer is coming soon. I remember that. I had that on the PC. In this remade dragon riding classic, you'll pilot the blue dragon through incredible landscapes. I don't think Episode Two ever came out. giant creatures and lethal <coughs> battleships. Using 360 degree controls and lock-on targeting. It's your destiny to reach the tower or Do I have it in here? When Panzer Dragoon Remake launches first on Nintendo Switch as a timed console exclusive today. I don't know. I might. I do have episode one. I haven't played it in forever, though. a lot though. more coming to Nintendo Switch. I don't know. It's somewhere. I'll just close blades. Yeah, I think that got delayed. EA. Oh, an EA game. Wow. <clears throat> Minecraft from Microsoft. Well, it's been fun, but today's Nintendo Direct Mini isn't over yet. This is our last news of the day. Breath of the Wild 2? Probably not. 
Oh, now, nope. for the latest information on the Pokemon Sword Expansion Pass and Pokemon Shield Expansion Pass. With an expansion pass, the world of the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield games will grow. The sprawling island in the sea, the Isle of Armor, and the frozen snowscape known as the Crown Tundra will be accessible in the Gala region. It's a new adventure to embark on with new people to meet along the way. Today we have some follow-up information about Part 1, the Isle of Armor. On the Isle of Armor lies a dojo for Pokemon battles where trainers gather to master their skills. And if you train at this dojo, you will receive the legendary Pokemon, Cub Fu, from the master, Mustard. Through your training with Cub Fu, you will receive permission to challenge the Towers of Two Fists mm -hmm. on the Isle of Armor. In this challenge, you will enter one of two towers, the Tower of Darkness or the Tower of Waters. You may only choose one, and you and Cub Fu must face this challenge alone. Once you've conquered one of the towers, <laughs> Cub Fu will evolve into Urshifu. Guess you could always have a if you choose the different tower file. Of darkness, it will learn single strike style. But if you choose the Tower of Waters, it will learn rapid strike style. Dark or water, the choice is yours and yours alone. Beyond that, the evolved form of your partner Pokemon, be it Rillaboom, Cinderace, or Inteleon, will gain a Gigantamax form as a reward for your adventure on the Isle of Armor. So, let's take a look at each Pokemon's Gigantamax form moves. Beating a giant drum and controlling its roots, it's G-Max Drum Solo. Kicking a giant ball of fire to deliver a powerful shot, it's G-Max Fireball. And blasting the opponent with water from 130 feet up, it's G-Max Hydro Snipe. These moves are stronger than Dynamax moves, and when used, the opponent's abilities have no effect when they're attacking. In addition to new outfit items and hairstyles, there will also be new league card backgrounds, effects, and frames. Now you'll have even more customizations to use to show off your personality. Pokemon Sword Expansion Pass and Pokemon Shield Expansion Pass Part 1, The Isle of Armor, will launch by the end of June. <laughs> also, for those of you who purchased the Expansion Pass, we've prepared this early purchase bonus you can receive by August 31st. <laughs> Alright. Starting today, during Max Raid Battles in the Wild Area, you'll have a higher chance of encountering the Gigantamax forms of Caparaja and Duraludon in Pokemon Sword, and Garbodor and Charizard in Pokemon Shield. Battle with other trainers to take on this challenge together. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct Mini. Thanks for watching. Switch light. So we got some stuff from Gearbox games and whatnot. Uh, that was actually pretty good direct. Um, yeah, so um, you know, I will be getting Xenoblade Chronicles extended, uh, extended edition, definitive edition. I'll be getting that. I haven't played the second one. I wouldn't have played that, but since the first one's coming to Switch, I'm going to play that. And then the second one, hopefully. Uh, yeah. So I do need to end this. Um, I do apologize, but I need to get ready for work pretty soon and do something else, get some lunch and whatnot. Anyway, um, I do want to thank you for watching this short stream, I know. Uh, there won't be another stream after this. In fact, I wasn't even planning on doing this, but, you know, stuff happens. So I'm going to get off now. Uh, I'll be back live tomorrow if you're watching me on Twitch. Probably do some uh, Phantom Pain and then some Animal Crossing New Horizons. So, uh, yeah, look forward to that. All right, I'll take care, Lava Dude. Uh, but without further ado, I want to thank everyone for watching this once again. Hopefully you have enjoyed the Direct. Let me know what you guys thought of it, what games you might want to get. And without further ado, I've been your host, and I will see you guys next time.